this is Rick Gottlieb, and I've just gotten uh, in the mail the other day my Tonewood amp, which is an effects processor that works strictly without an amplifier, which is, makes this really interesting. Now, what I find to be really interesting about this particular device is that it takes the guitar itself and uses it, the internal part portion of it, as if it were itself an amplifier. Now, part of the beauty of this, and what I'm thinking that this is going to be especially useful for, would be at conferences, at Folk Alliance, or at NERFA, or SURFA, where you're playing in a guerrilla showcase. And in that guerrilla showcase, it's typically a room that's well carpeted, has bedding all over, and there are chairs and particularly people, and it's a relatively small room. And because of that, acoustically, it's dead, completely dead. And so there's no re natural reverb in the room. And of course, that doesn't do anything for a guitar of any kind. So I'm kind of simulating right here in my studio uh, that same thing. You can look around me uh, and see behind me the acoustic treatment that basically is deadening this particular room. So what I've done is I have attached the um, uh, magnetic bracket on the inside of my softest sounding instrument which is an Alvarez nylon string guitar. And so now I'm going to play a little bit on the Alvarez, and then I'm going to attach the Tonewood amp so that you can hear what it really sounds like. So this is my Alvarez, such as it is. That's what it sounds like. It's nice. It has its own natural sound, but there's no reverb here. It's basically being all absorbed by the foam rubber around me. So now I'm going to take the uh, device, the Tonewood amp, and gently you'll notice that it's being held on solely by neodymium magnets from the inside. And I plug it into the port below, like so. And now I'm turning it on. And the first effect is called Hall. So this has the most profound effect. I'll turn up the sound a little bit so you can hear it. Now I'll take out the, the uh, jack so you can hear what it sounds like without the jack. And now I'm going to plug it back in. You can hear it. Going to the next uh, effect is called room. delay. The next effect is called plate, as in plate reverb.
effect is just delay. After that is a kind of a tremolo. is the Leslie effect, as in a Leslie uh, speaker that goes round and around and around. There's something called auto wah. By the way, in case you were wondering, I'm recording this with a stereo mic, uh, a Focusrite iTrack Pocket, in, directly into um, my iPhone. Lastly, they add Overdrive, for those of you that, well, play Metallica. Again, this is what it sounds completely bypassed. parameters on this can be changed, and I haven't explored them completely, but I can say with a great deal of certainty, I mean, this is on a nylon string guitar, mind you, and that's a very soft instrument uh, to begin with, uh, played in a very dead space, and yet this particular device is able to bring out the very best in terms, particularly in terms of the use of reverb. I think the, the hall the room and plate settings are particularly useful. I have yet to really explore as a singer-songwriter and uh, instrumentalist uh, using something like tremolo or particularly overdrive uh, for something like a, uh, a, an acoustic instrument, but who knows. I hope you've enjoyed this. I'll try and going to try and uh, reproduce this on a steel string guitar next, but I'll do that on my next video. Have a good day. Bye.